light. So this is a broadband light that would go from near the ultraviolet to 100 nanometers up to the near infrared. So this was around 2200 nanometers, so more or less in this range. The systems we measured were mostly in the visible and near infrared. So we were measuring between 400 and 1 micrometer, 1000 nanometers. So we had a white light source. And after that, we place a cuvette holder. Where we would put the solution of product in situ. And here we would we had we had a lens that was right here on this side where it would focus the light that would come here and pass through the cuvette it, it would focus into a optical fiber that was connected to a mini spectrometer here And this, the output of the mini spectrometer, we would send to a laptop for data processing. So, this was the first part of the experiment, and I will show you soon the setup you built. Later on, we measured the emission of rhodamine 6G. So the emission you cannot measure this way because there is a lot of background from the input light. So one solution is to rotate this cuvette. So for the emission, we we rotate this, this system so that the optical fiber will be coming up from the top. So you have now the cubit here, and now the emitted light goes into all directions, but you collect from this side and you place your optical fiber here and from here it goes to the spectrometer and in this way we remove the transmitted light here and you get only the fluorescence of rhodamine. Alright, so let us check uh, the setup we built.